guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I hope your week has been off to an amazing start and I hope you all are in good health. So today, you guys, I thought I'd come on here and share with you all a small fall home decor haul. So yes, I already have been, I already have started decorating my home for fall. So I have a whole playlist created on the channel. So if you missed any of my fall decorating videos so far, you can go ahead and um, watch my playlist and get all caught up. So I have a link down in the description box below, but I'm going to be decorating or not, no, so not so much decorating my, um, family room, but I'm also going to be giving my family room a much needed facelift for the fall season. So I'm going to be decorating for fall and also changing out some pieces in that room, just trying to give it a refresh. So this video that I'm going to be sharing with you today, a lot of the pieces are going in that family room, but then some pieces are going to stay here in the living room as well. So if you're new here, welcome. My name is Trina. I love to share home decor inspiration. I love to share interior styling videos with you all. So if you love that content, I would love to have you stay and subscribe and become part of our decorating family here and to all of my beautiful subscribers hey y'all welcome back to the channel and thank y'all for stopping by and watching another video so i'm not going to try to keep you guys too long but make sure you grab you a cup of coffee or a glass of wine i'm sipping on a glass of uh rosé so and then this is a new wine that i'm trying and i'll share with you the bottle if you guys can kind of see that in the camera this is what i'm trying out today so i'm definitely trying not to drink too much of the sweet wines i'm trying to move away from that so i thought i'll give this new wine a try so yeah so i've been to several stores i went to um i've been to um bed bath and beyond i got some things from target i got some things from cb2 i also got a small haul from grove collaborative and then also i have a new furniture piece that i want to share with you all that i'm so excited to share with you all so before we get started you guys i would like to thank today's sponsor skillshare so skillshare is an online learning community for creative people like you and me for people who like to learn new ideas and new skills and just kind of enhance their um, creative skills Side. So Skillshare is an online learning community. They have several classes on a large variety of topics. They have things to um, help you with interior design. They have classes on teaching you how to be more productive. They also have classes for web design, graphic design, and also photography. So it's very affordable. The classes are very small. They don't take much time at all. Some classes are like maybe like an hour and 50 minutes. One thing I do love about Skillshare is that they have so many different classes that you can choose from. This is probably like maybe my eighth time taking a class with Skillshare and all the classes I felt like they have been very helpful. So recently I have taken classes on interior design, also taken classes on how to make floral arrangements and things like that. But the most recent class I've taken was a photography class. Um, as some of you may know, or some of you may not know, I do have an Instagram account. So I always wanted to try to learn how to take really nice, um, kind of like magazine worthy photos. So they do offer a class on Skillshare is called iPhone photography, how to take, uh, how to take pro photos on your iPhone. So I felt like this class was really helpful because I always wanted to kind of develop my skills and taking really nice Instagram pictures and things like that for my various social media accounts. So I felt like this class was really helpful. The teacher was named was um, Dale McManus. And um, it just was a short class to kind of go over how to edit your pictures and how to not only just editing your picture, but also how to prepare your photos to be um, uploaded on Instagram or whatever social media you may be interested in. So I'll have the information for Skillshare down in the description box below. So the first thousand people to click my link will receive a free membership of Skillshare Premium. And thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this portion of today's video. The first store that I've been to, well, the, store, the first store that I went to was Bed Bath & Beyond because I was looking for some fall pills and I, you know, I, I've been, um, I'm trying not to buy any more pillows, but nonetheless, when I still go out to the stores, I always got to stop and try to find some pillow or whatever for my sofa. So I was looking for some cozy pillows for my family room. So I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I found, let me show you, and I found these gorgeous pillows right here. These were so super cute. I thought these would be perfect for 
uh, the fall season in my family room. It's very soft. Um, I love the little tassels that it has on there. And I love that it's a nice ivory. It looks white, but it's really like a nice ivory color because like I said, I am gonna change up some things in that room. So just stay with me with the, um, I'm gonna change up some things in that room. So I know that looking at some of this stuff, it looks like it may not go with that room, but trust and believe it will um, go with that room once I'm done making over that room. So yes, yeah, so I've bought two of these pillows. This is a nice size. It has, uh, it has a removable insert, I believe, yeah. So it has a removable insert. It has an invisible uh, zipper on it. And the name of this pillow is called B and Willow Home. This is a 20 by 20. So yeah, so I'm usually what I do is when, cause this one you can't really do the chop, but it still kind of have like that synthetic feel. What I usually like to do is I will take one of my, um, cause I got a lot of uh, pillow inserts already. So I'll swap them out for a pillow insert that I already have at home and change it and put it in here. So that way I'll be able to do the chop and kind of get that luxe look with it. But nonetheless, it's a really nice pillow. So this pillow was $30 at uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. And like I said, I did pick up two of these. So yeah, it's just a really nice soft pillow. And I thought this would be really nice for a uh, fall in my family room. So yeah, so that's that. I'm gonna set that there. So I got, that's one. And then I also picked up a second one from Bed Bath & Beyond too. But yeah, it's just very, cause that space, I know in my living room, um, as you can see, I decorated with the rust color. I'm absolutely loving it. I just love the pop of color. And for me, I just love to bring in the um, colors of fall season in my home. That's what I kind of like to do during the fall season. So I try to change it up and not do the same stuff that I'm doing all year round. So I'm definitely playing around with a little bit of color. I think last year in my family room, I used like, kind of like the mustard color. And if you see my kitchen video, my kitchen, um, my fall kitchen decorating video, I used the same color scheme in my family room last year that I put in my kitchen this year. So yeah, I'm trying to still I'm gonna lean towards that neutral ivory kind of cream with a little bit of touch mustard colors that I'm gonna be putting in that room. So yeah, so I picked up two of these pillows and I'm gonna set these here. Yeah, and like I said, they were they were $30 each. And then also I um I've been looking to change out the curtains in my family room because I've had those same um, curtain panels up there probably for over a year. So like I said, I want to change up that room, just trying to change out the decor pieces in there to give it a facelift. So I wanted to get some different color curtains. Right now I have kind of more of a charcoal gray color uh, panels that I have in there. So I found some of these blackout panels, if you can see it here. I found some blackout panels from Bed Bath & Beyond. And these are 100% room darkening because in that room, we always, we hang out in that room a lot. So we wanted to kind of be nice and cozy and we wanted to make sure it stays cool in that area of the house. So I've got these panels. They did come in several colors. They came in like a, um, a white, they came in ivory white. They also came in like a beautiful kind of light dove gray. Uh, and I think they had kind of more like a light, like a darkish tan color as well. So I picked up the ivory because as you can see, the color theme that I've got going on here, that I think it'll be look really nice. I wanted to get the white, but they didn't have any um, white panels left. They were all out of stock. So I just opted to get the, uh, the ivory color panels. And then I'm gonna show you what it looks like. So these were, I believe $39, $39.99 a panel. And then I got the size um, 84 inches long because usually in that room, my sofa kind of tends to go right in front of that window. So it doesn't really matter if they're, you know, 95 or 96, because that window is very small. So I think the 84 inches will work fine in that room. So like I said, this is what it looks like in the package. And then I took it out of the package. So it has kind of like, um, you know, just like it has like the grommets at the top which is kind of in like the pewter color, which is really pretty. So this is what the panel will look like. They're really thick, really heavy, um, good material. So that's what the panels are gonna look like when I hang it up. Just a really nice kind of soft ivory color. And then this will transition me into Christmas time too. So then that room would kind of be, well, the whole house will be already set up so I don't have to change out any of my um, main decor. I just love, I love decorating with neutral colors because I like to, when it's time for me to add a pop of color or decorate for the seasonal decor. I don't have to do a lot. I don't have to change anything because I already have everything a neutral palette anyway. So when you add in pops of color, 
color like this it kind of it uh makes the room just pop so that's what I, I like doing that so these are the panels that i got and i end up getting two panels and like i said they were 39.99 each at bed bath and beyond so yeah uh, ooh, ooh, i got something on there okay so let me try to fold this one up put this back over here these are thick okay <clears throat> put that there now now i did pick up let's see also i did haul a few things from grove collaborative so grove collaborative is an online um service that sells cleaning products that are all natural natural and organic cleaning products so they sell a lot of the method the mrs uh, myers or the mrs mayors and things like that so i picked up some of their fall scents so i love their uh multi-purpose sprays and if you have watched been with me for a while and watch a lot of my cleaning videos or some of my cleaning videos you know i love using the method multi-purpose spray and i also love using the mrs mayor's uh, multi-purpose spray as well so i picked up their limited edition um multi-purpose spray in acorn spice this stuff smells amazing i mean it really really smells good so it just kind of has like a, it reminds me of just fall in a can it has kind of like that um what sense did it have in here let me see if i can tell you what's in it it more has more like that cinnamon kind of maple smell it reminds me of it just smells like fall so it really is good so it smells good so i picked up like two of their multi-purpose uh sprays so when i do my cleaning and everything i got two of those so two of their multi-purpose sprays and i also picked up two of their hand soaps so I picked up two of their hand soap and all of it in the same, is in the same scent, acorn spice. So I picked up two of their hand soaps. Um, then I also picked up three of their dish soaps. So I picked up three of their dish soaps as well. I love their dish. I love their hand soaps. I love their multi-purpose sprays. The dish soap, like I said before, I love to use them for light cleaning. I don't usually... Um, deep clean like my pots for heavy grease on food particles and all that stuff i don't use this for that i usually still like to use my dawn dish soap for that but i do love to use this if i'm cleaning out my sink or just washing a few dishes and things like that i do love to uh, use their dish soap for that so i picked up three of these then um yeah then i also picked up one of their a set of their walnut little scrubbers these work really well so it has kind of a soft a soft side and then it has this um, kind of grainy side to help you kind of scrub up uh, tough spots and things like that. Like I said, all their products are made from natural ingredients. So they're not, they're, they're no, it's no harsh chemicals or anything like that. So yeah, this works really good. So I picked up that. And then and they usually always give you a free item. So one of my free items that I picked up was their sensitive soothing mist spray. So I don't know how this works, but I'm um, I will give it a try and let you guys know how that is. So that's it for Grove Collaborative for my cleaning products. And um, yeah, so if you haven't tried, I'll definitely recommend it. Now they do have other scents besides the acorn spice for fall because usually during the holiday time and the seasonal time like they'll have their limited edition because this is a limited edition scent so they'll usually have um different varieties of things so they'll have like they do have one called apple apple cider now i did i wasn't able to get that online i didn't pick that i didn't buy that online at all actually i actually picked up that brand and at target so target sometimes and target sometimes and then also your local grocery stores may have a few of these that you can kind of catch and um try it out um if you don't want to log on if you don't want to go to grow collaborative you can catch them sometimes at your local stores but they usually are all sold out so i was able to get a I get a few bottles of these also from target maybe a few weeks ago and they did have the acorn spice and then they also have apple cider i believe it's called so apple cider smells really good too if you kind of like at that apple um you know apple cider smell for fall they do have that one as well so i did pick up one of the multi-purpose spray in that scent then i also picked up a dish soap and a hand soap in that scent as well but they do still have all of their other traditional scents like lemon verbenum 
Um, they still have peonies, which smells really good. Um, so yeah, so they have a different, a lot of varieties or whatever. But if you haven't tried Mrs. Mayor's, I definitely recommend it. This stuff works good for cleaning off your tables, fireplaces, things like that, that you want to clean and just have your house smell amazing. So I definitely will recommend you trying out the Mrs. Mayor's and also the Method multi-purpose sprays as well. They work really well. So that is it for Grove Collaborative. So let me put this back in the box. Um, let's see. <clears throat> so if you guys are new here, fall is like one of my favorite seasons. I just love fall. I love it because I guess I'm, you know, I'm a Michigan girl at heart, even though I live in Texas. I am originally from Michigan and I just love the seasons, how it changed in the fall. I love the cool, crisp air, the leaves and everything changing around us. So I just really love that. So it's always been my favorite time of year or my favorite season. So in Texas, it's always kind of hot all year round. So we are just so excited to get some cooler weather down here. So fall is just one of my favorite seasons. So yeah so it's that time when you can actually truly go and enjoy your patio and then you can just you know enjoy some cooler weather so yeah so i did pick up um a few items from tj maxx so i did pick up these cute little hurricanes from tj maxx this is really cute so this is all it has kind of like this um ribbit this rib detail on it and it's really nice kind of amber color which i like and then the bottom has this kind of gold rim at the bottom which is really pretty and then this is the larger one so i picked up the larger one which was 9.99 i don't know if y'all can see that so i picked up the not the larger one which is 9.99 then i also picked up the smaller one which is 7.99 so this is the large and the small. And then when I got it home, I ended up cracking something on the side. So I have a little chip here on the side of it, but that's okay. Nonetheless, you're not gonna really, if I turn it to the back, you're not gonna be able to see it or whatever. But these were good, cause they're, like I said, they're hurricanes, but you can also use it as a vase too. So I'll probably end up using maybe one as a vase and then the other one put like a nice candle in it or something like that but i thought these would look cute in my family room it has that amber color that i'm gonna put in that room just a really nice soft neutral color and then also it kind of is a it has a warm you know like a warm cozy kind of vibe so i got two of those and then also from tj maxx i picked up one of their um olive oil seasoned olive oil um things or a seasoned olive oil oils or a seasoned oil I should say this is in roasted garlic so this was a $5.99 at TJ Maxx I like to get my olive oil and like different kind of um organic seasonings and things from TJ Maxx or home goods because at the grocery stores they'd be a lot more expensive if you bought them at the grocery store but at TJ Maxx they always or at home goods either one they always have this stuff reasonably priced so I love cooking um I'll use this for pasta or sauteing um different meats or vegetables or whatever this works really good for that so I picked and also this one came with a little spout too so you can um it's easily to pour out your oil so it's like a dip in oil is what it says on the bottle but and then it also has a cute little rosemary in there and then you it has some seasoning in there which you um can't really some of y'all can see that on the camera but it also has like really uh nice seasoning in there so yeah okay so that was it that i picked up from tj maxx i also went to home goods but didn't really find anything tj maxx didn't really have a lot of things they had a few they still have a few fall decor out um it's kind of like they rushed through fall and now they like moved on to just straight like halloween i even seen um home goods are already starting to put out some of their christmas stuff and i'm like oh my god it's like it's already <laughs> they're already putting out christmas stuff i'm still you know as long as still are decorating for fall but yeah they are already starting to put out some christmas stuff but you can still get a few pieces of fall decor if you uh, wanted to decorate your home um i try to share with y'all when i did my living room a lot of links that um of some of the items that i found that hopefully you guys will be was able to pick up some of those items um so i would definitely recommend trying to shop at some online retailer because right now because of covid a lot of stuff is just delayed 
and you're waiting a long time to get stuff but i would definitely try to shop like small business owners things like that etsy always have like is a good spot where you can get uh pillow covers and you know pumpkins and throw pillows and even candle holders and things like that you always find like unique items on there so i would definitely recommend checking out etsy as well or just try to check out some online retailers because you never know what you may find because some of the online stores you tend to they tend to you'll send them have a little more selection than what they have in the actual stores okay so i did um pick up I did pick up one item or two items from CB2. So um, I love CB2. If you don't know what CB2 is, CB2 is like um, an extension of Crate and Barrel. So they have a lot of modern decor and things like that. So I love shopping at uh, those stores. So they, I found these hurricanes. I I'm, if you don't know, I love candles. I love candles. I love hurricanes because they are versatile. You can always use them for um, a vase. You can use them as candle holders. You can just use it just for decor. You don't really necessarily have to put a candle in it. But yeah, so I found these cute hurricanes from CB2. And I'm going to show you. So I picked up the larger one and the smaller one. So these are the hurricanes that I picked up. This is the larger one. I love this hurricane because it's kind of dusty because i had uh florals in there because i'm getting ready to do a styling video for you all so stay tuned for that but yeah so i picked up the larger one and this is this, you can see how big this one is it's almost the size of my head that's how big this one is and it's in this kind of like this smoky kind of dark chocolatey uh color so it's really nice and like i said you can put a large candle in here or you can use it for a vase and put a me a, a few floral stems in it but it's really pretty um this was actually i think the larger one was um i have to get the price but i believe the larger one was maybe maybe about thirty dollars or something like that it wasn't no more than thirty dollars for the larger one so i got the larger one and then i also got the little baby one as well so I can't remember the pricing, but I will have these linked down in the description box below if you guys are interested. But they're just so cute. They're just so cute and modern and sophisticated. And I thought this will look really nice on my um, credenza. So I thought this will look really cute. So yeah, I love the, like I said, the dark cocoa kind of smoky color it has on there, which is perfect for fall or any year around, but it is definitely be fitting for fall. So yeah, so, so this is what I got from CB2. Very nice. So for a while they were sold out. I did have to wait a little bit because when I originally ordered these, um, I don't know, back in the beginning of September, they were sold out and I had to wait till they come, come in. Well, I had to wait until they came in stock, which they just came in stock like the middle of September. So hopefully you guys will be able to grab your, get your hands on um, some of these candle holders as well. But they are just so cute, so sophisticated. So yeah, so that's what I picked up from CB2. Now I think that I have two more stores and then we're almost done with this haul. So I did go to Target because like I said, I'm getting ready to do my family room over. So I'm trying to find some new pieces for that room. So I'm gonna, I picked up some throw blankets. Well, I picked up a new throw blanket, a few more pillows from Target as well. So Target had some really cute uh, hand towels for fall. So, and they had these all the way in the back um, where the bathroom stuff is at they had these cute little hand towels so this is but all of these are by the threshold brand and each towel i believe were five dollars so i thought these were so super cute because it's kind of hard to find um decorative seasonal towels like i haven't really i've been having a hard time trying to find some really cute ones even cute kitchen towels i've been trying to find um having a hard time finding some really cute ones to kind of match my uh decor what i've been um decorating with so i got these cute ones here this one is just a solid white towel and they have these cute little orange pumpkins on the front if you guys can see that i know the pumpkins are orange but i figured that i will grab them now because i can also use it next year if i don't put it in my bathroom this year but it's still neutral enough that i can kind of add it to my bathroom because you know my bathroom i added more of the neutral kind of natural tones in there as well but i just thought this was so cute so i couldn't pass it up but i love the little orange pumpkins on there and i love that it's still a nice neutral kind of white towel so i got that one then also they had this cute one here which is kind of like in a nice chocolatey kind of tan color and this one just says welcome fall on the bottom of it welcome fall and it has like a small little leaf and then this one was really cute too and both all of these towels are 100 percent 
uh, cotton. So they are really good thick materials. They will last you for um, many years. So very good. So yeah, this wasn't bad for five bucks. So I got this one here. Then also I picked up uh, this really pretty one here. And then this one is just kind of like a neutral one with some, the towel is ivory. And then it just had to have these beautiful kind of tan colored leaves on the front of it, which I'll probably end up putting this one in my bathroom uh, now for this fall season because it's neutral enough to kind of match with what I got going on in there. But I just thought that was really cute. I love a really good hand towel or kitchen towel. Just nice. These are really good, uh, make really good decorative towels for your bathroom. So, yeah. So I got that from Target. Okay, let me put this here. <clears throat> then also from Target, I picked up a new throw blanket. So this is also by the Threshold brand as well. And then this blanket is a 50 inch by 60 inch. So it's really soft. I love that sweater, kind of sweater feel, kind of blankets and throw pillows, all that cozy uh, material. I just love to decorate with that for the fall. So yes, yeah, so I picked up this large blanket for our sofa. So this is in like that mustard color, because like I said, it'll look really pretty with, um, you know, as you can see here, let me see if I can kind of grab this here so you can kind of see it'll look really pretty with this kind of color. This is the kind of color, this is the color combination that I'm planning on putting in my family room. So it kind of plays off of what I did in the kitchen. So, cause the family room is, is right uh, connected to the kitchen. So all of the colors are kind of play off of each other. So that's, so it all kind of flow together really well. So yeah. So yeah, so this is a nice chunky throw blanket and this throw blanket was $30 at Target. Target has some really nice throw blankets. I love their throw blankets. They're just so soft and cozy and they last a long time. And this one, they had it in different colors. They had it in a white, they had it in a charcoal gray. Um, I think I even seen kind of like a rust color, but it wasn't like this rust color that you see behind me. It's more kind of like a, brownish orange color rust color so yeah so yeah so they have several of them um at target and i'm quite sure you can find these online the stuff that you get that i haul from target i know you can find those online so i'll have the links down in the description box below if you guys are interested so also from target i found these cute little throw pillows i love these pillows these are from the let me see if it's the same i love these pillows because um I just love the texture on it. I just thought these would look really cute for fall. It has this kind of nice little uh, texture on the front. And then it also has a nice zipper at the bottom. And it also has kind of like this brass zipper, which is really cute. And then this is in the size of, this is probably more like a 16 by 16. Let me see if it has the size on here. It's, oh no, this one is an 18 by 18 inch pillow. And then I love this because this one is actually, let me see what the brand is. This is also by Threshold. Threshold has stepped their game up with some of their decor pieces. I mean, they are really going more modern, more elegant. They have some really nice uh, home decor pieces. So this is by Threshold as well. Like I said, it's 18 by 18. So this one, you can't do the chop on there, but like I said, it does come with the removable zipper, removable pillow cover. So you can, um, you can zip it unzips and then you can change out the insert if you want which i'm probably going to end up doing is changing it out and putting in one of my um down feather field ones or whatever in my because i have like i said i have tons of them laying around the house anyway so i'm just going to change it out but yeah i just thought this was really cute and this pillow was um i think this pillow was 30 bucks no this pillow was 20 dollars yeah, this twill was $20 by Threshold. So yeah, I thought that was a really good deal for $20. So it's not bad. And as you can see, like I said, it pairs well with this. It pairs, pairs well with this. So that looks so good together. So, so you can kind of see, I got like, I don't know, I'm down here on the floor. So I hope y'all can see what I'm showing y'all. <laughs> so, but yeah, you see it pairs well with this. Then also I kind of got these nice candle holders to kind of go in there so you can kind of see the theme or the look that I got going on in that room. So yeah, so let me see, got this one here. Let me see. Yeah, so I thought this was so super cute and I thought this was a really good deal for 30 bucks. So I ended up picking up two 
of those pillows from Target. So yeah, and this one now, they did have other colors in this as well. Let me see if I can put that there. Okay, yeah, they did have other colors in this one. They had um, a really light, they really had like a really light ivory color. I think I seen a, um, a pretty gray color. So they did have other colors as well. I mean, you can't beat the price for 20 bucks, especially when you're decorating for fall, you wanna add like cozy. To me, one way you can make your house cozy is changing out um, your everyday pillows and adding some stuff with some texture to it, you know, cozy uh, fabrics and velvet and like just different kind of, uh, materials would have really helped kind of cozy up your space for the upcoming fall and winter season. So yeah, so I picked up two of those. And then also from Target, I picked up, I needed a new mat to go in front of my sink um, for the kitchen. I didn't want a whole runner. And there's, I did a runner before, but I, I wanted a mat just to go right in front of my sink. So I picked up this mat here which is really cute and this is by threshold brand as well and then this matches my kitchen to a t it has kind of like this gray and white kind of what is this buffalo check pattern on there and then this rug is a this rug is a 24 by 36 so it's a nice rug it's pretty thick this is actually a indoor outdoor rug so you know when you're decorating your porch you can use something like this to kind of layer your doormat i shared on my instagram how i styled my front porch for the fall season and on a how um, for the fall season i had on uh, for the fall season i did one thing i did do on my porch was layer my um doormat so you'll start with a rug like this and then you will put your decorative doormat on top so that's one look to kind of enhance the look of your front porch that's um one tip i was to like uh that i would share with you guys that you could do and actually they kind of got it here on the picture as well how they hit uh layered it in with their doormat so you can use this as a outdoor rug or you can use it in your kitchen like me. I'm just gonna use mine in my kitchen because I needed a new one anyway to go in front of my sink. So that's what I'm gonna be using it for. But yeah, but you can use it for um, outdoor as well. So we are almost done with this haul, you guys. So if you're new here, I would love to have you stay and subscribe and become part of our decorating family here. Um, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps on my channel a lot. Don't forget to catch up on all my other fall decor videos if you haven't checked, caught up on any of those videos as well. But I have one more piece that I want to share with you all before I let you go before I let you all go. So I did buy a new furniture piece. So I did change out my credenza. Um, if you guys are new here, I had a white credenza in my dining room area that I got from Home Goods. I since sold that piece. And now I have a new piece that I got from Tall Furniture that I wanna share with you all that I absolutely love. It's absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, it's amazing. So I'm gonna share that with you. I'm gonna turn the camera around and kind of give you a glimpse of that new furniture piece and now this furniture piece it is it is one of their um credenzas that i got from tall furniture is in the is all black and is in the lacquer finish it is in a lacquer finish then also has some nice acrylic handles on there with a little bit of gold detail now this buffet or credenza is in stock as of when i ordered it and so just be in mind i'm gonna have the link lit I will link it down in the description box below, but just keep in mind that um, it does take about three weeks before you actually get it because it took me at least three to four weeks to actually get the item. But if you look, compare it to some of the other places when you go into furniture stores and you're trying to buy new furniture, they're talking about, I mean, 30 weeks, a long time for furniture pieces. And by the time you know I do all that, I've been changing my mind, I got something else. But nonetheless this is a beautiful piece i want to share with you all like i said i have the link down in the description box below so i'm going to change the camera around and share with you all this new piece okay you guys so we're in my dining room area so this is the new piece that i picked up from tall furniture so yes i'm absolutely loving it you guys it is so gorgeous so this is the piece and i believe this piece is 73 inches wide by 36 inches tall so it does have really pretty acrylic legs down at the bottom as you can see 
it has really nice gold detail on the front i just love the design of it it's very modern very um very modern very contemporary and i felt like this piece fits my space a whole lot better than kind of the other previous credenzas that i had here i did go ahead and move this lamp it was in my um living room on the tape on my uh side table so i moved that lamp over here just to kind of see how it will look over here on this side of the room i still have my same artwork up there on the wall that i had previously in my um home tour that i share with you all but i just absolutely love 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 this crend cred this cred um love this credenza so the best thing i love about it is the doors and the drawers the doors are soft soft clothes um i love the material on it it has kind of like this lacquer material it's kind of dusty and dirty because i um just got and i just started putting um some of my new furniture piece or some of my home decor in there already so it's uh super heavy like i said it has this kind of shiny lacquered material on it the doors have this cute little pattern design on there that i absolutely love and then it also has these acrylic handles on there as well with a little bit of gold brass detail and i love it because the doors kind of open up like this so they kind of open this way oops yeah, they kind of open this way and then already kind of went and start putting um some of my storage in there so i have some candles so those are some of my fall candles at the top i also have some chargers and napkin rings and some extra coffee table books on that side and then also in this end i like this things it can hold so much uh decor so i have some extra as you can see i love <laughs> love my candle holder so all those on the top i have been i was able to put a lot of my home decor pieces in here to kind of free up some space and other parts of the house so i have my candle holders at the top and then i also have some extra decor pieces down at the bottom as well and then on this other side i also have some um more decor pieces as well so this cabinet you are able to hold a lot of items now you can use it and put in a lot of your dishes and things like that i'm just mainly using it right now to hold in uh, some of my decor pieces and i also have some of my um dining room essentials down there like my chargers and my napkin rings and things like that but you can hold so much more and the best part of it is that the shelves are uh, adjustable so you can kind of raise it to the height your desired height with no problem my other credenza you couldn't do that at all the shelf was kind of shelf was kind of fixed in there so you can adjust it you can remove it can do any of that so it kind of really limits you on what you can store in there but um i absolutely love this cabinet you guys it is so gorgeous and they do have it in other colors i have mine in the of course the uh, uh the jet black but they do have it in a gray i believe and i want to say they have it in they have it in like a soft gray the gray is kind of almost like the color of my wall back there but i think they do have it in a white and I think they may have it in the blue. I'm not sure. But they do have um, different styles as well if you guys are interested. So I have their, their information linked down in the description box below if you guys are interested. But yeah, I absolutely love it. And I just think it really adds a nice, um, elegant touch to my dining room. I just really think that I needed something like this to kind of make this side of the room really pop. So I think it just works better. So I think it works better for... Uh, my space and I think it works better for the dining room. So it was what I was been looking for I found this credenza maybe about a year ago, but it's been it was out of stock for a long time So I didn't want to wait until it came back in stock So I've ended up buying that one from home D from um home goods Which I should have just went ahead and just waited until this one came back in stock and just got this one in that way I wouldn't have to be buying duplicate furniture but nonetheless, I absolutely love it. So if you guys are interested, like I said, I believe it's still in stock. So I'll have a link down in the description box below for you guys. But yeah, that is it, you guys, for my little uh, home decor haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you it brought you at least some home decor inspiration or some decorating ideas. So I thank you all so, so much for watching. And I'll see you all in my next one. Bye.